In 1865, Maxwell proposed the electromagnetic wave theory. According to this, light is an electromagnetic wave. It has electric and magnetic field vibrations, perpendicular to the direction of wave propagation. These fields vibrate in two mutually perpendicular planes. Light looks like a transverse wave. Each wave has a specific plane of oscillation. These oscillations can be in any direction. Electromagnetic waves are produced by excited atoms. Different atoms vibrate in different directions. So common sources like bulbs or candles emit light with vibrations in many planes. This is called unpolarized light. If the light vibrates in only one plane, it's called polarized light. Unpolarized light has vertical and horizontal components. We show this using arrows, in plane and dots, out of plane. Now, when unpolarized light passes through a Polaroid, only vibrations parallel to the crystal axis pass through. This light is now plane polarized. This process is called polarization. Two key terms in polarization are, one, plane of vibration, contains the light's vibrations. Two, plane of polarization, perpendicular to the vibrations with no motion. If I0 is the intensity of unpolarized light, then polarized light's intensity becomes I0 slash 2. Now, pass this through another Polaroid, the analyzer. If both axes are parallel, intensity remains I0 slash 2. If they're perpendicular, no light emerges, intensity is 0. This is Malice's law. I equals I0 cos square theta.